craptacular day all around, but a great day for playoff football for the Hungry McGee Sticks and Snacks highlights. First up, Moroa Forsyth hosting Westville, a familiar foe from the last several years. So the Trojans ready for another run. The defense is nothing going for Westville early on as the Davian Severado is corralled for no gain. Trojan with the ball, Clayton Sprint fakes the handoff and gives it to Aaron Enda on the end around. And he is gone. 64 yards to Pater. Just like that, 7 to nothing. Moreau Forsyth with the lead. More defense for the Trojans. Duncan Hathaway trying for a screen pass. Look at 44, Clayton Sprague step in for the pick. Read that perfectly, Trojans in business. Sprague then draws back, looking for the middle. Josh Gilbert hauls it in for the big yards. Nice catch, Trojans are driving. Then Sprague again, Gilbert again, touchdown. Trojans look great after one quarter of 14 to nothing on Westville. Cameron Nicholas on the kickoff return. Sam Singh strips the ball and West Lima good follows up with the hit. Ball comes out. Merle Forsyth recovers. It stayed 14 nothing after one. The second, more defense. It's the Singh Live and Good connection. Hathaway's pass batted down by Singh and caught by Live and Good for the pick. Nice defense. Even more defense coming. Austin Walker reads that run perfectly. Nice tackle. Stop for no gain. There was also a Trojan offense. Spray with a pump fake. Throws it up for Parker Barrett. Great catch for the touchdown. 21 0. Merle Forsyth with the lead. Looking good. But Westfield did drive down the field on a double pass play, setting up Ladavian Severado. He takes it in the end zone for the score. 21-7, Trojans lead. The Merle Forsyth strikes back. Clayton Sprague throws it over the middle to Logan also Nice jumping grab. The drive continues for the Trojans. Chad Howell then takes the handoff, and he easily goes in for the score. And Merle Forsyth moves past Westville in the Class 2A playoffs, 33-12. Up next, St. Teresa hosting West Central in the 1A playoffs. West Central, nothing flashy with constant runs, and the St. Teresa defense was stifling early on. On 4th and 17, West Central, they hand the ball off to Lance Barrett, who burst free for 28 yards and a touchdown. Cougars are up 6-0 in the first. Wow, on 4th and 17. Bulldogs come back in the second. Ryan Fike gives it to Jordan Dennis who takes it around the outside for positive yards. Good game there. Then later in the drive, Jacardi Wright works his way to the outside. Touchdown, Bulldogs. And we are tied up at six, heading into halftime. Jacardi Wright, he breaks free and works his way toward the sideline. He might go. He doesn't quite go all the way, but a huge gain for Wright, and the Bulldogs are in business. Fourth down and four in the red zone. Fike looking to hand it off, but the ball comes free. Kobe Huber picks it up for West Central and takes it all the way back to midfield. St. Teresa couldn't cash in. In the fourth, West Central did on a sweep on the outside. Touchdown Cougars, 12 to six. They lead late in the fourth. The Bulldogs need to answer back. Ryan Fike, he's looking, throws it up for Mike Davis, but the ball is picked off. And St. Teresa just ran out of time. As the Bulldogs fall to the West Central Cougars tonight, 20-12.